Hello and welcome to my match simulation of tonight's Survivor Series Champion vs Champion match between this man, Sami Zayn, and the current United States Champion, Bobby Lashley. So Sami Zayn representing SmackDown and Bobby Lashley representing Raw in this match. So yeah, we're going to find out who the game thinks will win. And uh, I'd love to hear from you guys. Let me know in the comments who you think will win this match. They had a feud a while ago, actually. Uh, Sami Zayn and Bobby Lashley, just thinking about it. Remember that awful segment with Bobby Lashley's sisters? Yeah. That was during a feud between these two. So no strangers to each other. But now both the, uh, the mid-card champion on their respective brands... We get to do battle. And if you want to know who I think is going to win uh, each particular match, then after you're done watching on my match simulations here on Ibeza Sims games, I'm going to head over to WWE Baser, uh, link in the description, and I'll be doing a predictions video over there. So make sure you subscribe here and there, and uh, don't miss any of the videos. But uh, now it's time to get Lashley out here with his United States Championship. Looking very confident is Bobby Lashley with the old US title. Obviously the new one not in the game yet. We don't do updates. Especially not to this game. <laughs> The new Intercontinental title, actually, as well. I just realised this is a battle between two guys holding outdated championships. Fun fact. Also, Lashley, no reference to the Hurt business in his attire or entrance or anything. So, outdated Bobby Lashley as well, really. And Sami Zayn, without his wild hair and beard. So, kind of everything about this match is outdated. Congrats, 2K. But, nonetheless, we're going to use it as... A bit of a predictor. See who the game thinks will win tonight. So Lashley's in the ring. Sami Zayn's moving around into position. The US title's coming through Lashley's jacket. Even though it's over the top, so it's actually going through it for some reason. Whatever. We're ready to go. Sami Zayn looks relaxed. Lashley looks ready. We've got an Ole chant to kick things off. Oh, but then we get a back elbow and straight into the Gorilla Press. Bobby Lashley showing the size and strength advantage that he has over Sami Zayn. Kicking him down, kicking him while he's down, I should say. Right forearm to Sami Zayn. Sami's not got any offense in yet. Lashley now choking Sami Zayn across the middle rope. And another back elbow drops Sami Zayn to a knee, in fact. Oh, there's a big clothesline by Sami Zayn and decides to dip out of the ring. He's not had a good start. Look at him pacing about. He's not having a good time here. He's got to regather his thoughts. He probably should have capitalized, though. Look at Bobby Lashley doing the intimidation thing, doing that flex. But, uh, yeah, he probably should have capitalized while he had Lashley down there, Zayn, because now, once again, Lashley's in control. Zayn's barely got any offense in. Oh, slingshot. Oh, he lets go with one hand to show off the strength. Into the vertical suplex. Oh, Sammy blocks the haymaker. And now what's he got in mind for Lashley? Oh, is he going to slingshot suplex as well? Yeah, very nice. Very nice by Sammy Zayn. Anything you can do. Maybe not anything, because there's definitely a size and strength disparity here. But in terms of technical wrestling, yeah, anything you can do. Oh, nice roll through by Sammy Zayn. I thought he might have tried to hook that for the quick pin. But he doesn't. Instead, opting to try and stay on the offense, but Lashley straight back up to his feet. Backbreaker by Sami Zayn. Now Lashley straight back up again though. Oh, reverse STO. Drops Sami Zayn face first. But then as Lashley goes to follow in, Zayn kicks him in the head. And gets back on his feet. Bit of back and forth in, in the second act of this match, if you like. The first section was all Bobby Lashley. And now it's been kind of back and forth. There's the back elbow again, though. He's used that very effectively. Oh, he went for a fourth one. Zayn blocked it. And now down into a crossface by Sami Zayn. 
No, Lashley just powers out, rolls Sami Zayn off, but Sami Zayn follows it up with a, a heel kick. Oh, Lashley showing speed of his own though, going behind and then hitting a gut buster. Now goes for the first pinfall attempt of the match, only gets a one count before Sami Zayn kicks out. Gonna take a little bit more than that to put Sami Zayn down for the count. Oh, double underhook overhead, belly to belly suplex. I had to think what I was trying to say there. And Bobby Lashley pats himself on the bum to say job well done. <laughs> the taunts are outdated as well. Thankfully, he doesn't still do that. Uh-oh. Setting up for a powerbomb position. No, up into the Dominator. No, he was trying to hold a backbreaker, in fact. But Sami Zayn managed to grab the top rope and escape. Now, what's Lashley going to do to follow up? Deadlift into a gut wrench powerbomb. Great strength and goes for another pin. One. And again, Sami Zayn kicks out at one. At what point does Lashley begin to feel frustration with these one counts? He hit a big clothesline there. He's going to keep his head in the game though. Sami Zayn kicks Lashley off. Oh! Pushes up off Lashley into a drop kick. Nice follow-up move by Sami Zayn there. Now he's in control for the time being. Kick to the back, lower back, and then one to the chest as well. Now Zayn going up top. What's he got in mind here? Oh, goes for a big splash. He hits it, hooks the leg. First pinfall attempt by Sami Zayn. One. No, he only gets a one count, and he's a lot more frustrated by it than Lastly was showing that he was from his pins. Could that end up playing into the result of this match? Hurricane Runner could be a factor. That's all I'm saying. Oh my god, Sami Zayn hyping himself up with that crazy facial expression there. Lashley tried to crawl up in the corner, but Sami Zayn snap mares him out and then a drop kick to the back while Lashley was down on the mat. What has Zayn got in mind here? Oh, reverse STO. Lashley did that before. Oh, into the Koji clutch. Could he make Bobby Lashley tap out? That would be quite the result for Sami Zayn. Lashley a bit too far away from the ropes, I think, there to reach out and grab it. Sami Zayn elects to let go. That's an interesting decision. Will he regret that? Oh! Switches it up into a crossface now. Will Lashley tap? One submission into another. Referee's right in Lashley's face, checking he's not submitting. And again, Lashley pushes Sami Zayn off. But again, Sami Zayn follows it up with a heel kick. Back body drop by Lashley, though, on his way up. Oh, and again, as he goes to follow in, Sami Zayn kicks him in the head. He's caught him twice with that now, kind of playing possum a little bit. DDT by Sami Zayn. Right forearm, staggers Lashley. And follows it up with another DDT to put Lashley down. Again, bringing him back up to his feet. Once he's down, you might want to keep him down. Here we go, this might be why. Kick to the leg, kick to the gut. And lift him up into that backbreaker again, but this time drops him down face first. Referee in position for the pin. One, two, no, only just a two count. And now Lashley starting to show signs of frustration. Sammy beating two frustration, but now they're both there. Snap their takeover by Sami Zayn. Now he's got a rear chin lock trying to slow down the momentum of the bigger man. Oh, Lashley starting to fight his way up. Sami Zayn doesn't want that. Oh, elbow to the gut. And a second one. La uh, Sami Zayn, no choice but to let go. Lashley hooks him up. Up into the vertical suplex. Oh, he holds him up in position. Look at this strength walking around in a circle. He lets go with one arm. And finally drops Sami Zayn after letting the blood rush to his head. Follows it up with a pin immediately. One, two. And he got him. Bobby Lashley picks up the win for Raw. Let me know in the comments if you think that's how it's going to go down tonight in real life and Survivor Series. Also, leave a like if you enjoyed this video. Uh, subscribe if you'd like to see more simulated gameplay. And share with your friends if you think they would enjoy what I do. But for now, all I have left to say is thank you very much for watching. As always, I've been Ibeza. You've been amazing. And I'll see you next time.